And now, your WLKY weather with Chief Meteorologist Jay Cardosi. Okay, outside right now, we do have thickening clouds. We've gone overcast after what turned out to be a pretty nice day. The rain shield itself, not too far away, but folks, it's making very slow progress northward, if at all. There are chances that the rain might not even make it to the metro on this Monday evening. We're in even 50 degrees, cloudy skies, humidity 41%, a north-northeasterly breeze right now. 15 to 20 miles an hour, kind of gusty out there, getting kind of cool. But, boy, low 50s, especially for February, we'll take that, right? Here's your detailed 12-hour forecast for this evening. This is for the city itself. That 50 will cool down into the 40s as the evening hours unfold. That chance for a little bit of light rain, mainly this evening. By midnight, I think we're dry again as skies will even be clearing after midnight. Uh, and we'll see some sunshine returning first thing tomorrow morning. So here's your radar scan. You can see the metro still in the clear as far as rain goes. Boy, it's not far away. We're talking the capital city down through Taylorsville Lake. About the southern one half of Bullitt County, just south of Brandenburg, Hardensburg. Right now, the parkways, some pretty hefty rain. But again, its northern extent, at least that reach, has really, really slowed down. And this might be just about it. The future cast, it's got a great handle as to what's going on. By 8, 9 o'clock tonight, it's stating that we could see a little bit of light rain in town. But the better chances, the farther south you go. And speaking of heading farther and farther south. Notice the pink shading in our far southern communities. Those are the regions that have the best chances of picking up a little bit of wet snow late this evening for a few hours during the early overnight. And then everything gets a kick off to the east by two o'clock in the morning. Boy, we're drying out everywhere with skies clearing after that. That means that all sunshine will make a return for your Tuesday. So the bottom line, rain the southeastern one half of the viewing area tonight and a little bit later on this evening through the early overnight, uh, there could be a change over to a little bit of slushy wet snow. Places like Lebanon, Campbellsville, Greensburg, Columbia, you folks have the best chances where there could be an inch or two of slush on grassy areas, rooftops. Could even be a little bit of a coating on the roadways as it's falling. Once it stops falling because of the warm ground temperatures, any slushy spots will quickly melt away. This is the region that's going to get hammered from this storm. Some of the big cities of the Northeast, Philly, New York, Boston, looking at six to possibly 15 <laughs> inches of snow. They can have it. Weather around here tomorrow morning, clear. We're sunny and we're gonna hold on to bright sunshine from start to finish. On your Tuesday, temperatures will be seasonable as we'll be in the middle and upper 40s for afternoon highs. Here's your forecast for this evening. Rain the south half of the viewing area. A little bit of wet snow could try to mix in south of the parkways. We'll be in the 30s and 40s. But I tell you what, we're, we're sunny tomorrow and after a chilly start, we'll warm into the upper 40s to near 50. Vicki, beautiful on Valentine's Day. We're 55 and sunny. 56 Thursday, another system rolls in Friday with it. Chance for a little bit of rain shower activity could end as some flurries Friday night. A weekend looks dry, just kind of cool with Good. low and middle 40s. But yeah, uh, you know, after chances for a little bit of light rain and downstate Kentucky, a little bit of wet snow. Boy, got great weather on the way the next three days.